हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल दिस इज फ्लूड मैकेनिक्स पार्ट 11 इसरो क्वेश्चन पेपर फ्रॉम 2006 टू 2016 क्वेश्चन इज ए स्मॉल प्लास्टिक बोट लोडेड विथ फिशेस ऑफ स्टील रॉड्स इज फ्लोइंग इन ए बाथ टॉप इफ द कार्गो इज डम्प्ड इनटू वाटर एलंग द बोट टू फ्लोट एम्प्टी द वाटर लेवल इन द टॉप विल हाउ मच यर हियर इन केस वन स्मॉल प्लास्टिक बोट लोडेड विथ पीसेस ऑफ स्टील रॉड्स एट दैट वेट ऑफ स्टील रॉड्स इज डब्ल्यू हियर डब्ल्यू विल एक्ट डाउनवर्ड एंड बुएंसी फोर्स एक्ट अपवर्ड and in this case water is boat is floating empty and that cargo is dumped into water so the steel rods they are here your force of buoyancy let it be w1 w2 एफ बी टू फोर सब बुएंसी टू हियर द वाटर लेवल विल फॉल बाय डेल एच हाइट यू कैन डू दिस एक्सपेरिमेंट इन योर बाथरूम ऑल्सो द वाटर लेवल विल फॉल सो बी इज आवर आंसर हियर density of steel is very very much greater than density of water and density of steel greater than density of plastic in case one that uh, weight is W is force of buoyancy. That is volume of fluid displaced into rho g of water. In this case, the volume is more. And in second case, W dash into F V. and w2 equal to fb w2 is very very greater than because it's at the bottom fb2 here it's occupying less volume so that water level will fall you can do it in your bathroom that experiment in first case volume of fluid displaced is more and and in second class volume of fluid displaced is very less and next four cars with a mass of 1500 kg each are loaded on a 6 meter wide 12 meter long small car ferry how far in cm will it sink in the water In centimeter, we have to calculate. Data given are mass one five double zero kg for four cars. Mass is for one car. For four cars, mass is. जीरो जीरो के जी एंड एरिया इज सिक्स मीटर इंटू ट्वेल्व मीटर सिक्स इंटू ट्वेल्व मीटर स्क्वायर हाइट वी हैव टू कैलकुलेट हाउ मच इट विल सिंक इन द वाटर सो 
we know for four cars weight is downward force of buoyancy is upward so w equal to fb w is mass into acceleration due to gravity 6000 into g equal to force of buoyancy is volume of fluid displaced into this liquid is water area into height height we have to calculate into rho g of water g value we can cancel then 6000 equal to 6 into 12 into h into density of water is 1000 so 6 6 6 cancel then h equal to 1 by 12 it's in meter but in option we have to calculate in centimeter so 1 by 12 into 100 then we will get 8.3 centimeter from option D is our answer water enters a turbine at 900 kilopascal with negligible velocity what maximum speed in meter per second can it reach before it enters the turbine rotor so Bernoulli's equation will apply here P1 given 900 kilopascal so 900 into 10 to the power 3 kilo newton per sorry it's newton per meter square p1 by rho g plus v1 square by 2g plus z1 equal to p2 by rho g v2 square by 2g plus z2 z z cancel then for maximum speed p2 will 0 p2 by rho g this term will 0 with negligible velocity so v1 also 0 then p1 by rho g equal to v2 square by 2g g g cancel then v2 square equal to 2 into p1 by rho or v2 equal to 2 into p1 value is 900 into 10 to power 3 divided by rho rho is water density so it's 10 to power 3 it's root over cancel then v2 equal to 1800 root over so from option we have to start 42 square is 1764 it's nearby so b2 is 42 unit is meter per second so a is our answer question is given that specific gravity of mercury is 13.6 intensity of pressure is 40 kilopascal express the intensity of pressure goes in various units si units bar then meter of water then meter of mercury so first data given or specific gravity of g is 13.6 p is 40 kilopascal or 40 into 10 to power 3 newton per meter square then different units we have to calculate so 1 bar equal to 10 to power 5 
न्यूटन पर मीटर स्क्वायर सो पी इन बार वी हैव टू कैलकुलेट फर्स्ट पी इज फोर्टी इंटू टेन टू पार थ्री न्यूटन पर मीटर स्क्वायर फोर्टी इंटू टेन टू पार थ्री डिवाइडेड बाई टेन टू पार फाइव यूनिट इज बार सो टेन फोर बाई टेन इक्वल टू जीरो पॉइंट फोर बार सो फ्रॉम हियर वी कैन कॉट ए एंड सी देन इन मीटर ऑफ वाटर हैव टू कैलकुलेट पी इक्वल टू रो जी एच एफ वाटर सो एच एफ वाटर इज P is फोर्टी into टेन to power थ्री divided by density of water is टेन to power थ्री into g take approximately अप्रोक्सीमेटली टेन सो फोर मीटर ऑफ वाटर सो दिस वन ऑल्सो सैटिस्फाइंग एंड फॉर थर्ड वन वो हैव टू कैलकुलेट इन मीटर ऑफ एच जी Here फोर्टी into टेन to power थ्री divided by density of mercury is थर्टीन पॉइंट सिक्स into टेन to power थ्री into g will take टेन फोर फोर बाई थर्टीन पॉइंट सिक्स फोर्टी बाई वन थर्टी सिक्स देन टेन बाई थर्टी फोर इक्वल टू फाइव बाई सेवेंटीन देन फिफ्टी जीरो पॉइंट टू देन टू पॉइंट पॉइंट टू नाइन इज मीटर ऑफ एच जी so from option this one also satisfying b is our answer least one and least two matching pelton wheel francis turbine and kaplan turbine we know pelton wheel is high head low discharge and francis turbine francis is medium head and medium discharge and kaplan turbine लो हेड एंड हाई डिस्चार्ज सो पेल्टन हुईल विथ सिंगल जेट हाई हेड लो डिस्चार्ज ए बी सी ए फोर देन फ्रांसिस टर्वेन medium head and medium discharge it's 3 then kaplan turbine low head high discharge low head high discharge 2 4 3 2 so a is our answer pick up the incorrect statement for centrifugal pump discharge is proportional to diameter head is proportional to speed square Head is proportional to diameter square, and D discharge is proportional to speed. For pumps, we know power head and discharge Q. It's 
से डी क्यू डी स्क्वायर एंड डी टू पार फाइव सो डिस्चार्ज इज प्रोफेसनल टू डायमीटर क्यू सो ए नॉट पॉसिबल हेड इज प्रोफेसनल टू स्पीड स्क्वायर विल चेक दैट हेड इज प्रोफेसनल टू डायमीटर स्क्वायर दिस इज करेक्ट डिस्चार्ज इज प्रोफेसनल टू स्पीड सो स्पीड ऑल्सो वो हैव टू राइट एन क्यू एन स्क्वायर एंड एन हेड इज प्रोफेसनल टू स्पीड स्क्वायर दिस इज ऑल्सो करेक्ट डिस्चार्ज इज प्रोफेसनल टू स्पीड दिस वन एंड दिस वन सो दिस इज ऑल्सो करेक्ट सो इनकरेक्ट स्टेटमेंट इज ए डिस्चार्ज इज प्रोफेसनल टू डायमीटर हियर डिस्चार्ज इज प्रोफेसनल टू डायमीटर क्यू सो ए इज आवर आंसर अदर आर बी सी डी दे आर करेक्ट स्टेटमेंट्स नेक्स्ट इफ द डिस्चार्ज ऑफ ए सेंट्रीफ्यूगल पंप इज थ्रटल्ड देन इट्स सक्शन लिफ्ट ए डिक्रीजेस बी फास्ट इनक्रीजेस एंड देन डिक्रीजेस सी रिमेन्स ऑन चेंज डी इनक्रीजेस इट विल इनक्रीज डिस्चार्ज ऑफ ए सेंट्रीफ्यूगल पंप इफ इट इज थर्टल्ड देन इट्स सक्शन लिफ्ट विल इनक्रीज डी इज आवर आंसर A cylindrical body of cross-sectional area A height capital H and the density rho s is immersed to a depth small h in a liquid of density rho and tied to the bottom with a string. The tension in the string is how much? Tension in the string is downward. Weight also downward. Weight of the body and force of buoyancy. It's upward we have to calculate the tension t so force of buoyancy volume of fluid displaced into specific weight of the immersed liquid immersed liquid is the density given rho so area into small h into rho into g then w we have to calculate weight of the cylindrical body its volume into rho g of body here its fluid immersed fluid volume is area into capital h into density of body is rho s into g so if v equal to w plus t from here we will calculate t equal to force of buoyancy minus weight of the body so a into small h into rho g minus a into capital h rho s into g take a and g common rho small h minus rho s into capital h this is our required answer so from option t equal to a not possible b this is rho s rho s rho s rho h minus rho s into capital h whole into g a so b is our answer a manometer measures the pressure differential between two locations of a pipe carrying water If the manometric liquid is mercury with specific gravity 13.6, and the manometer showed a level of difference of 
20 centimeter then the pressure head difference of water between the two tappings will be how much so sm equal to 13.6 s of water is 1 and height in terms of hg it's 20 cm or 0 0.2 meter then pressure head difference in terms of water we have to calculate rho hg into height hg equal to rho w into height in terms of water hw we have to calculate height in terms of water so rho hg into hhc by rho w so it's 13.6 into 10 to power 3 to it's 0 0.2 divided by 10 to power 3 10 to power 3 10 to power 3 cancel 13.6 into 0 0.2 it's 2.72 meter from option b is our answer flow takes place at Reynolds number of 1500 in two different pipes with relative roughness of 0 0.001 and 0 0.002 the friction factor we have to check Reynolds number first we have to consider Reynolds number is 1500 pipe flow so it's laminar flow Two important things I will tell you for laminar flow and for turbulent flow. For laminar flow, friction factor F is depend on RE only, it's independent of. relative roughness independent of roughness but in case of turbulent flow it depends on re and relative roughness both are important for ias exemption so many times they ask this one laminar flow it's a function of Reynolds number only it's independent of relative roughness and in turbulent flow it depends on Reynolds number and relative roughness so this is laminar flow because up to 2000 it's laminar so from option A will be higher with pipe A not possible will be higher for pipe B also not possible, will be same in both pipes. This is our answer. Because it's independent of roughness. It depends on only Reynolds number. And both pipe is having same Reynolds number. So friction factor F is same in both cases. So C is our answer. A liquid compressed in cylinder has a volume of 0 0.04 meter cube up 50 kg per centimeter square and a volume of 0 0.039 meter cube at 150 kg per centimeter square. The bulk modulus of elasticity of liquid we have to calculate. So our formula is K equal to del P by del V by V. It's minus. Del P is faster. 150 minus 50 kg per centimeter square so it's 100 kg per centimeter square del v is volume changes from 0 0.01 mit, 0 0.04 meter cube to 0 0.039 meter cube so it will come 0 0.001 meter cube and V is V1 
जीरो पॉइंट जीरो फोर मीटर क्यू सो के इज डेल पी इज हंड्रेड देन डेल वी जीरो पॉइंट डबल जीरो वन डिवाइडेड बाई जीरो पॉइंट जीरो फोर सो इट्स फोर बाई हंड्रेड एंड हियर वन बाई वन थाउजेंड हंड्रेड हंड्रेड कैंसिल इट्स फोर थाउजेंड के जी पर सेंटीमीटर स्क्वायर सो फ्रॉम ऑप्शन डी इज आवर आंसर थैंक यू फ्रेंड्स थैंक यू फॉर वाचिंग माय वीडियो इफ यू लाइक माय वीडियो देन सब्सक्राइब इट एंड शेयर विथ योर फ्रेंड्स थैंक यू